Right now we're at a drawbridge that separates North Hero from South Hero Island. Let's go talk to the manager guy and learn some more about drawbridges. Traveling, exploring, and learning on the road. From his family road trip. Drawbridge is a type of movable bridge typically associated with the entrance of a castle and a number of towers surrounded by a moat. In some forms of English, including American English, the word drawbridge com commonly refers to all types of movable bridge, such as basketball bridges, vertical lift bridges, and swing bridges. A basketball bridge is a movable bridge with a counterweight continuously balance its span or leaf throughout its upward swing to provide clearance for boat traffic. It may be signal or double leafed. The name comes from French term for balance scales which employs the same principle. Basketball bridges are the most common type of movable span because they open quickly and require very little energy to operate while providing the possibility for unlimited vertical clearance for marine traffic. Well, we already know Press about... Press button on the bridge or something to open it. You'd want a job like that? Maybe. Well, look it. Looks like riding a sailboat would be fun. A sailboat would be fun. Seems, Seems like we found out the answer to our question. Do the sailboats have to pay? No. How do you know? Because look at they're just flowing right through. They don't stop, pay, and then go. But when we go through a toll booth and we have our fast pass thing, or easy pass, we don't stop and pay. Maybe See that one? Like that, that one's slowing down. I don't even know. We'll have to ask. Are there certain hours that boats can go underneath it? Every hour and every half an hour. Yeah. How do you make them? How do you make them? Well, this one is electric motors, but we're going to get a new one next year, and it's all going to be hydraulic. How do you know when the boat they talk to me on my marine radio right here. Nice. How long does it take for the bridge to go up? It takes the total to go up and down eight minutes. Four minutes each? Four minutes each. Do boats have to pay? No, it's free. It's free. Is there a control room? Yes, that was what I was just in. What do you do when there aren't boats? I have to do other chores. I work for the state of Vermont, so whatever they tell me to do. Where are the weights? Excuse me? Where are the weights? Are there any weights? Weights? Yeah, on each on, the, on the, each end of the arm, there's a big counterbalance weight. It weighs about a thousand pounds. Is that light? It's like that and, and then that and then that and Right. You can't bring the bridge down together because it would bind. So one. We have a north side and a south side, so one's got to go down first before the other. And then they have what they call these span locks. It looks like a big dog bone, you know, like a, you know, what a dog bone looks like. Well, that once the bridge is down, they have to go in with pressure under electric motors, so they lock because the weight of the bridge will bounce, bounce, bounce. How do you control the bridge? Um, just with push buttons and hydraulics, I mean in electrical, like I said. So like single push a button? Push a button and hopefully it don't work. We had it up, we had it stuck one summer, last summer for an hour. You want to talk about people that were mad. We had traffic backed up to Burlington. And then if there's lightning or, or uh, thunder, we can't open the bridge because, uh, you know, we might make the bridge is metal, of course. Excuse me? And there's water! 
That's right. Good, smart guys. All right, I gotta go. I gotta do some uh, book work. Okay. Okay. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Okay. Nice Thank seeing you. you. Have a nice summer. Okay. Take care. Thanks. Bye bye. Have fun. So, did you learn good stuff? Yeah. I learned that there's weight on the bridge. Weights. Drawbridges today. Give us a thumbs up and check us out on Facebook or our Cummins Family Road Trip. 